The hot tub open. Lift it up. Oh, oh it's steamy. Down. Don't, don't bring me 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 down. Good morning, YouTube. Just give me a second. What's up, YouTube? Paul Greenberg here from Keller Williams, and I'm back at it again with another full day in the life vlog. Today is going to be crazy. Remember David and Scott from vlog number two? They got beaten multiple offers a bunch of times. Well, they bought a house. We're doing a purchase visit. We're gonna do some measurements in the house. Check it out, see what's going on there. And then later in the day, I'm stopping by my clients, Josh and Jenna. They bought a house in the summer. I haven't been by to check it out yet, to see what they've done with the place, because they're creative. They love their design, so I'm super excited to see their place. Gonna pop by their place later in the day, check in with them. But now, I gotta hit the gym, as always. So, I will see you in a second. And I'm ready for the gym. Took some pre-workout. Don't try this at home. So I'll check in with you after the workout. Boop. Nope, not gonna hit it again. Back from the gym, that was a crazy workout. I couldn't film because it was packed. So my workout looked a little something like this. Yesterday, you said tomorrow. So just do it! <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna get changed. It's coffee time. I'm at an all time. Alright, so I'm at my first appointment with David and Scott. We're doing a purchase visit on their house. They get to go measure, see if everything's working, get you know, get back inside the house. Last time we saw it was at night time, so it's kind of nice that they get to go back during the day, check it out, and get a feel for it. They're late, as always, so as soon as they get here, we'll say what's up. You guys excited? Yeah. Yeah? Welcome home, this guys. Is, I, like, I remember it. Yeah. But we were in really quickly, so now I can actually appreciate it. So I'm just gonna give you guys a quick tour. The kitchen. I feel like you thought this was more yellow than the next Sweet. So yeah, so purchase visits are basically so you can come in, measure, get a second look, because a lot of times buyers are really, really quick in the places. They don't really remember what they buy, so in the offer, I write that you get two or three purchase visits. So you can come back, test all the appliances, make sure everything works, and yeah. You guys wanna go outside? Let's go Let's go show them what actually sold you the house. The basement? <laughs> turn it around. The basement? No, oh, turn me? It around. Oh, I sold them, I sold oh. you guys the house. I sold you guys the house. I didn't sell you the house, because I, I don't like to push people like that. <laughs> but like, Good day. outside, outside, the hot tub open, lift it up. Oh, oh it's steamy! God. There's a rubber ducky in there? Oh, that, go? that rubber ducky is gangster! Oh, we're it. getting a rubber duck. So we have a backyard for the dogs. It's a little overexposed, that's fine. We have to measure 
everything. So okay, we do. Wanna, start let's do. A, take a let's take a look yeah. around, and then we'll uh, we'll measure. So this whole place is like all controls. It's wired for sound, and they get this all because I put it all in the offer. Actually, it's because the guy put it all. In the he show. actually, yeah, he offered to give it to. But I like to say that I, you know, put it all in the offer. All the TVs, everything. It's pretty. Uh, it's pretty sweet. I love this house. I really do. And which, which is nice. It's a, it's a row house, but it's like it's quiet, so it's you know, it's not it's exactly what we need. Yeah, get, but like you don't hear your neighbors, which is oh, nice. Yeah, no. Like we live here already. <laughs> <laughs> Wine and pop and water and water. And, oh, I'm free crap. Yeah, it is actually like you guys in here. Amazing. Look at Scott being on camera. All right, so we're gonna go take a look at downstairs. I'll show you the basement. They did a really good job down here. Actions. We can get the reactions when they come downstairs. Oh, look at that! To your basement. <laughs> Walls and stairs. Walls and stairs. That's gonna be the intro clip. <laughs> I'm not even joking. <laughs> Oh, I can't wait. I love these floors. I love the floors. The floors were actually one of my favorite parts of the space. These floors remind me of something that we would have looked at for a condo. I'm so happy that they bought this house. Like, I'm so happy they got this house. I can't even, it's like the perfect match for them. They went and they lost in a couple places on multiple offers. But this came around and this was like the exact perfect fit. And that's why I say like, don't stress if you're losing because the right house is gonna come around. And this came out literally three days later. So it's pretty crazy, pretty crazy. So you're happy with it? So happy, so happy. Yeah, yeah I think this is great. It's a good size bedroom. A really good size bedroom. Yeah. It's perfect for what we need. It's perfect for our furniture. I'm so excited to be able to put our like our actual furniture. bedroom set. Yeah, it's like this is just just the perfect house for these guys. It really is. It's like it's really the perfect house for these guys. You guys. So they close. They close in a month. Exactly a month till they close. Is it? Yeah. It's like it's, it's a month. It's a month. A month in two days. A month in two days. Oh my god. Yeah. It's pretty awesome. So we just wrapped up with the purchase visit. How excited are you to move in? So excited. I cannot wait. I got all my measurements ready to go. Got to pick colors. Got to look at all the exciting stuff that we can do inside and get started on moving. Amazing. So congratulations. Thanks, buddy. Congratulations. We're going to come back here in two weeks, test out all the appliances, make sure everything's working. Everything's in good working order. If there's a problem, you bring it up before closing. That's a pro tip. That's what you do. I gotta get back to Toronto, go to my next appointment. Where are you guys going? Uh, dinner. Dinner? Yeah. I wish I could join you. I'm gonna, you're invited. I'm gonna eat a protein bar. Awesome. All fun. right, try safe. Peace. Uh, see ya. A few moments later. At the LCBO. This focus is crazy. I'm just looking for a bottle of Moe. So, just filming the LCBO. I found it. Boob. Let's get some boob. Very excited to get this. All right, mission accomplished. So, you got it right here. I'm gonna head back to the city and get going. I'm in Oshawa right now. Clarington, Cordis, somewhere, one of those places. Somewhere random. Somewhere random, as always. As always. <laughs> um, so, have you thought about that loft? Like, what's going on in your head? Yeah, like, ugh, I've been going so back and forth because it's so, like, Beautiful, you know, yeah. I love all these things about it. I just feel like I would, I can't deal with that lack of storage. We go down, together. One it
eternity later. All right, so I'm on my way to Josh and Jenna's. Well, I'm just about to leave my place. I went up quickly, showered, changed, put on a fresh shirt because I've been in my car for way too long today. I know this episode's not really, really content heavy, this vlog, but you're kind of getting to see what it's like being a Toronto real estate agent. I'm going to touch base with you guys when I get to Josh and Jenna's. All right, see ya. All right, so I'm on my way to Josh and Jenna's. I got their gift. I always get a parking ticket. I remember every time we were showing, uh, we would always get parking tickets on the street. So hopefully we, I don't get a ticket. So I'll see you inside their place. Hello. <laughs> I'm at Josh and Jenna's. How are you doing? Can yeah. I walk up? Uh, sure. Go up. Give the tour. You can be on camera. Give me the tour, Jenna. All right, so you're coming upstairs. Well, we love that. It's a century home, so it's a 102 years old. Wow. So an old baby with yeah. lots of love, lots of love in here. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Bathroom. Some heated floors. Nice. Oh yeah, I remember this. My office. You did a great job. This is like way better than the last people. This I want to turn into like a little meditation room, reading room, so I can work. Yeah, that's awesome. Look at that chair. And then here, you got some history. The house was built by the same guy who built Casa Loma. Seriously? His, his kids lived in this home. Seriously? So he he built this place at the, the same year that Casa Loma was built. The Casa Loma was finished. Look at that, you guys are getting a history lesson too. Yeah, there you go. This is our room. You got the king size bed. Oh yeah, we did it. Amazing. Look at that fireplace. That's amazing. I love the white and the random sink. Have you been using the sink? Is it oh like, yeah. Is it like, I, use it for, I use it for makeup. It's Get super ready in useful. The morning. Awesome. And then probably your favorite room. The, the closet. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. Amazing. Giant. Giant mirror. You have to be up, up, upstairs. Yeah. I only have one light on, but. Oh, nice. It's like a guest bedroom. Guest room, yeah. Those lamps. Yeah, they're cute. That's, on. that's awesome. And then the outside, you're gonna have to come back in summer. What do you do? Oh, to see the outside? Just so the outside. That was like the first thing that we did because the outside was so disgusting. Yeah. That they just look. Like, <laughs> um, so what was cool about this was there was an offer night set up for it and it didn't sell on offer nights. So we actually jumped on it right after. They got the house, the end is history, we're going to hang out. I'll see you back at home. So that's going to conclude this vlog. You might be a little confused, I'm not wearing the same outfit. This is a couple days later. I didn't film the outro when I got back from Josh and Jenna's. I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. And also, my cousin sent me this video earlier today. I'm disappointed. I'm upset. I challenged you. You totally failed. Not only did I see it, about seven, 8,000 people, I believe, also saw it. What do we do from here, right? I don't have to keep challenging you to eat food. Uh, I'd, rather, I'd like to get some other challenges going, but part of me wants me to let you redeem yourself. Is this a good decision? I, I, I don't know. I kind of liked seeing you fail. I think a lot of people kind of liked seeing you fail. So let me do this. This is what we're gonna do. My next challenge to you will be another food challenge, but this is so you can redeem yourself. I think you could do this one. Maybe you can't do this one. Maybe this is a bad idea. Okay, no, no, no. We're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. I'm gonna challenge you for next week. You know what, you know, I'll let you pick the day when this one comes out. Don't want you to rush on the editing. I'll let you pick. This challenge will be, I want you to eat 50, 50, 50, let's, 
50 chicken McNuggets. Same rules apply. We have to do it in one sitting, two hours, and you can pick all the dips you want. You can do whatever you want. You could, you could pick fry. You could, you could get fries again. I, I still don't know why you got fries, but you can get fries again. And your big soda instead of water. I still don't get it, but 50 chicken McNuggets. Challenge is on. It's up to you now. So it looks like I'm doing another challenge. Check back next week. 50 nuggets, it's going down. Once again, thanks so much for watching. Have a great day, and we'll be talking soon. Down, don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down.